Why are two of the most famous women in the music industry at odds? Let's delve into the events that led to this recent fallout. Before we jump in, here's the context. Reports have surfaced that Kenny invited a group of strippers to his home while Nikki was away on a business trip. Kenny's ex-girlfriend, Redbone, has come forward, claiming he never loved Nikki and was using her to resolve his financial troubles and legal issues. Redbone also alleged that Kenny stayed with Nikki to escape from her. Meanwhile, Cardi B seems to be benefiting from her rivalry with Nikki. During Cardi's public meltdown over Offset's infidelity, Nikki mocked her. Now, irony has struck as Nikki faces infidelity issues herself, with Kenny allegedly cheating on her with multiple women in their own home. If you've been following social media, you might have noticed people criticizing Nikki's husband for his criminal record. In 1995, he was arrested for the attempted sexual assault of Jennifer Hugh when he was 17. After pleading guilty, he served four years. Jennifer later sued both Kenny and Nikki for attempted intimidation, but the case was dismissed due to lack of evidence. Many critics argue that Nikki is jeopardizing her career by staying with Kenny, who isn't contributing to her life positively. Despite Nikki being the primary breadwinner, Kenny is reportedly cheating on her while she works. He was seen bringing strippers to their house when Nikki was in Trinidad for a fun fair. A blind item revealed this scandal, noting that Nikki's probation for failing to register in California prevented Kenny from joining her on her trip. Rumors spread about their separation and Kenny's refusal to accompany Nikki on her international tour. According to the news, Kenny and strippers were at their house during Nikki's absence. While Nikki attended Trinidad Carnival 2023 dressed in violet, it became evident that Kenny didn't join her. This was confirmed when Nikki purchased a new home for $19 million. Kenneth, required to keep his address updated to stay registered in California, claims to live in a mansion, which is not the same as Nikki's new estate. They previously shared a home where Kenneth currently resides. Speculation about their marriage troubles has grown, fueled by Redbone's allegations of Kenny's infidelity. In response to the widespread rumors, Nikki posted two cryptic messages on her Instagram stories. And one day, they're yelling, push, and you're in pain. Then one day, he comes out, a beautiful baby boy, to God be the glory. Furthermore, she mentioned that when you exude enthusiasm, people tend to reciprocate. Now, here's the peculiar part. Redbone had previously made a negative comment about Nikki when Nikki revealed her relationship with Kenneth in 2018. Redbone accused Nikki of stealing Kenneth with her fame and wealth. In response, Nikki clarified that she had no issues with Redbone, but felt she was interfering with her relationship with Kenneth. Nikki explained that she and Kenneth had been childhood sweethearts who reconnected and fell in love again. Meanwhile, a theory was circulating suggesting that Redbone was friends with Cardi B's best friend, Star Brim. This led some to speculate that Nikki's relationship with Kenneth was a subtle jab at Cardi B. However, I doubt Nikki would intentionally date someone to spite Cardi. Despite the rumors, Nikki has reportedly chosen to stay silent about her alleged breakup with Kenneth, not wanting to be ridiculed for enduring so much for a man who cheated on her. Meanwhile, Cardi B is mocking Nikki now that Kenneth's affair has become public knowledge. It seems Nikki's worst nightmare has come true. All right, Nikki and Cardi have been going back and forth for what feels like weeks. 
They're and, their and their husbands. And their husbands. And their husbands. And their, and their, and their friends. And their and fan bases. Yeah. It's World War II out there amongst the girlies. It is. It's been too much, too yeah, much that has happened. It is believed that Nikki thinks this is Cardi's way of getting back at her for mocking her during her emotional breakdown over Offset's infidelity. A few days ago, Cardi B went on a wild rant, accusing Offset of cheating and ruining their marriage. In case you forgot, this is something worth remembering. When I'm not the most confident, they like, he likes to play games with me because he knows I'm not an easy girl. He, he knows yesterday I could have been out, I could have been chilling, I could have been this and that. He knows I'm in my house. He knows that I'm chilling. He knows I'm not doing the most. And I've really been sparing you. I've really been sparing you. You've been feeling yourself, you because of your album and and you've really been doing me dirty after so many years that I'm up your ass. She broke down in tears and shared her emotions with those around her, who responded with support and compassion. However, Nikki chose to be spiteful and mocked Cardi, seemingly making light of her pain. Around the same time Cardi was having an emotional outburst on live TV, Nikki tweeted a Michael Jackson meme. For context, Offset has been channeling Michael Jackson in his music videos for quite some time and even has a tattoo of Michael on his stomach, making Nikki's jab obvious. This led to backlash against Nikki, as people did not appreciate her insensitivity. Nikki's timing was particularly cruel, kicking Cardi while she was down, and Cardi quickly retaliated. It's unfortunate that these two continue to engage in petty feuds. Now, what are your thoughts on Nikki's unfaithful husband and Cardi mocking her for it? Share your opinions in the comments below.